Are you solving the wrong problem? Yep, 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 yep. And like I say, if you're not getting healing results, chances are you're solving the wrong problem. So what I'm going to do is give you examples of times in my life where I was confronted with a problem to solve. Pretty big problem. And focusing on the wrong pro on, on one problem would give me one set of results. But focusing on a different problem would give me different results. As many of you have heard this story, and uh, I've told you many times. So when my husband died four years ago, I had been sitting in this chair uh, 12 to 16 hours a day working and also uh, taking care of him uh, at least for two years as he was bedridden. So I was before the uh, government order to stay at home, I was pretty much staying at home <laughs> and I was sitting. So when he died, I realized, oh my God, I can barely walk. I mean, I can't get to the bathroom, but really not much more than that because my legs were so stiff. Now, before he died, I mentioned this to my husband. He says, oh, don't worry. I'll make you a nice, wonderful cane. And so the problem then, as presented to me, was that I did not have the proper device for walking. All I needed was a cane. And was it this cane or was it that cane? And even after uh, his death, I was walking with two canes. Yes, two canes. So if I had to go any distance or I was hiking, I would use two canes. And um, I realized that I was having a lot of difficulty walking. And so the question was, what was really my problem? Was it that I lacked the proper device? Did I need better canes, maybe a wheelchair, a walker, another assisted device, maybe a ramp for my house, or, you know, an electric uh, chair that could lift me up over uh, short, short uh, stairways or something. And I decided, wait a minute, the real problem here is I am too weak to walk. And so I took a Taekwondo class. <laughs> yes, I was at the bottom of my class, but I did sign up for this Taekwondo class full of teenagers. What are you going to do? And uh, I had been doing yoga for like mm, 20 years. And so I went to my yoga instructor and said, hey, could I have one-on-one -on -one instruction? I just, I'm just not making any progress here. And she thought that was just really ridiculous. I just needed to do more downward dogs. Now, uh, so I uh, quit, I quit yoga, just, but no more yoga. Because I've been doing it for 20 years, right? And I had come to this situation even while doing yoga. So I was doing Taekwondo. I realized I could barely get through the one hour class. And then I realized I had a dietary issue. And that's when I discovered organ meats and uh, I got more energy and stronger and more strength. And I said, hey, wait, I can, I can do more stuff. I can, I can do a backward bridge, maybe. Maybe I can try something else. And so I did find someone who would help me stretch. And I was able to do a backward bridge and splits. And, you know, things have just gone from one thing to the other. But because I chose to solve the problem of being too weak, not the problem, of getting better assistive devices, my future looks much more different. So in other words, had I decided to solve the problem of assistive devices, I would probably have a house full of uh, canes and walking devices, whatever. But now uh, I have even had to get rid of armrests in my chairs. 